Hello friends and welcome to another episode of Win Brit's Shits, where you can win my shits. The keyword is shit. Can you tell that I'm being like partially like owned by the sun right now? It's like Whoa. We will start off this episode of Win Brit's Shit with a very awesome rad donation by Sage Mantis, which is an awesome little like repair slash retro like gaming trading store in Virginia. And Sage Mantis see if I can do this smoothly enough. Oh yeah, are you ready for it? Has donated a Zappa. For those of you children not in the know, this is an NES Zapper for the Nintendo Entertainment System way before the Wii U and the 3DS and things that you will likely know of today. Uh, made primarily popular through the game of Duck Hunt. I'm sure you've seen that around. If not, you've probably seen Duck Hunt and Smash Brothers. Conveniently enough, Sage Mantis has also donated one of these bad boys, which is super cool. God, I love freaking Duck Hunt. It also comes with Super Mario Brothers 2. Not Super Mario Brothers 2, but Super Mario Brothers as well. I feel like everyone had like their tactic for Duck Hunt, right? Like that thing that made them feel like they were really good at it. You know, mine was that I like to like put my, the zapper like right on the edge of the, the oh, and speak, this is kind of relevant. Uh, this will only work on um, older TVs, you know, the nice tubi, the tubi TVs, so your fancy pantsy flat screens will not pick up this, which will make you very sad, because you won't be able to play it. So FYI, but anyway, I used to always put this against like the glass of the, of the, uh, the TV, and I would like think I would be really good, because I would just like follow the ducks around with my little like barrel, and it never really worked though, it wasn't a very good strategy. So, yeah. Huge thank you to Sage Mantis for donating this, and if you run a store or you want to donate anything for the Windbrit shit, let me know, send me an email, leave a comment, find me on Twitter, find me on Facebook, I don't care, just find me and get a hold of me. <sighs> so fun! The next item you can win comes from my actual collection, um, Barkley Shut Up and Jam. Yes, children, this is, this is a real gem. This is a real gem. If you want on eBay, it's gonna cost you at least four dollars. So, you can get it for free right here. God. Are you uh, in need of a new lanyard in your life? Well, if so, I have an Aperture Laboratories lanyard for you, friends. And it, see, it goes around like this, and then you, you pin like something to it. And then you look all suave. And then you can be like, yeah, I work for Aperture Laboratories. And then all of the boys and all the girls would be like, oh my god, are you a scientist? And you can say, yeah, and make up an awesome rad story about your pseudo career you know, where you develop portal guns. So now you have the zapper, now you have a Mario Bros. duck hunt combo, you have Barkley's shut up and jam, and you have an awesome lanyard. What else do you need in your life, children? Well, I will tell you, you need Deadpool socks. Yes, these are what you need in your life. And you can have these Deadpool socks. I don't know how big of feet won't fit in them. What? I don't know. If anything, you know, if they don't fit your feet, you can wear them as like, rad mittens or something well friends i think that'll do it for this episode of win brit's shits may i bestow the best of luck upon ye um and may you win may the chances be greater than the chances of finding the triforce and ocarina of time i thought that was a good one to enter just click the link in the description and that'll take you to my blog and then you'll see like a handy dandy little like raffle copter thingy that you just enter and then you just keep your fingers and toes and other bodily parts crossed for good luck. Have a swell rest of your day and I'll talk to you later.